Hi guys, welcome back to another YouTube video. Um, if you're new, welcome. My name is Nkem. I'm a YouTuber based in England and I do videos on um, fashion, lifestyle, nursing. Um, I hope you decide to join the family. Today we're doing a brand new video on fashion. I've always wanted to do this video. I'm really pleased today. I've always wanted to do this video and I hope you guys will like it. And if you want to know what it is, let's keep on watching. Okay, so we're doing a fashion styling video. Um, I've wanted to do this for a long time. I always do like unboxing and fashion hauls. Um, but today I wanted to do like fashion styling, basically restyling things that I have in my wardrobe. Some of them are new. They're new things that I bought that I haven't actually worn. Um, a few of them are things that I've worn or shown you guys before. Um, I just, you know, we are in a cost of living crisis and it would be a very good idea to try to rewear or restyle some of the outfits that you have in your wardrobe so uh, without wasting any more time let's get into the video okay so the first thing on my list is brown blazers I got these brown blazers from Debenham it's a boohoo brand it's a boohoo product but it was sold to me on Debenhams um, I always shop on Debenhams you guys know me well I have a lot of things that I bought from Debenhams and I've shown you guys quite a few of those things um, but yeah um, I don't think I've worn this jacket out I think I got it um, a few months ago probably just worn it once um, but I wanted to restyle it and show you guys how you know I would wear it over and over again okay the first style or idea that I have in mind is to pair it with this pink, cute pink skirt that was gifted to me by my friend. Um, the skirt is from River Island. I haven't actually worn this. Um, this was, I think I got this in, in January or February. I can't remember the exact month, but it's, no, January. December, January. 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 <laughs> January. <laughs> Um, that was when I got this um, skirt. I haven't actually worn it, but I'd like to pair it with brown blazers and of course wear this brown bodysuit. I got this bodysuit from Pretty Little Thing. I've had it for such a long time. I've worn it several times. Um, but yeah, I feel like it's going to be a good fit. And it's going to look really, really nice. I'm going to pair um do pink accessories and i'm going to do brown accessories just to show you guys the two different ways you can wear this i don't think i have a brown shoe i do have i think i have one anyway i just i'm going to show you guys <laughs> um but i'm thinking i could do um brown bag and brown sneakers and then i can do brown heels and, sorry and i can do pink heels and pink bag um so you can wear this in two different ways the accessories make you know sort of makes the style different for you every time that you want to wear it which i feel like it's a nice nice um twist to add to things okay um another way you can wear this is to swap the skirt for um a blue denim uh jean so denim is something that is in trend this year you're going to see especially this spring summer you're going to see a lot of denim looks um denim paired with other out fabrics and denim on denim it is something that i've researched and i've seen that 2023 uh spring summer forecast we're going to be seeing a lot of denim um we also know that denim is like a staple piece in your wardrobe it should absolutely be in your capsule collection um, if you want me to make a video on in the right capsule collection or outfit, wardrobe, capsule wardrobe, that's the correct correct terminology, capsule wardrobe, please let me know and I can show and sh share with you guys. But yeah, I would definitely uh, switch it up with denim, probably change the top to like a white camisole or something else that I have in the wardrobe. 
um, style that with heels to elevate the look and sneakers to make it a lot more casual. The second thing on my list is um, a pair of white jackets as well. Um, you've probably seen me wear this before. I've probably just worn this twice. Um, the first time I wore it was for my birthday in Montenegro. I paired it differently. I paired it with a lace see-through um, trousers that I got from Pretty Little Tin. Um, and then I wore, I wore it a second time on my trip to Manchester for my friend's birthday weekend. So these are the two times that I've actually worn the outfit. And for the trip to Manchester, I paired it with um, white trousers. So for the two times I've worn this, I've actually worn it with white. It was like an all white outfit. So today we're styling it differently. Um, the first way I'm going to style this outfit. Um, so I'm going to style it with a sleep dress. So if you watched my last video of outfits um, for Valentine's Day dinner, you would have seen this outfit. You would have seen this dress. I got this dress from Debenham as well. You guys should give me a brand deal or something. It's kind of cool. Just something nice. Um, I'm going to style it with that sleep dress um, just because, you know, it's a very pretty dress. It's a very dinner, you know, it's a, it's a, it's a rom com kind of feel vibe. It's just a very nice, um, flowy, beautiful, and kind of relaxing outfit. Um, so I'll style it with that, put the, I'll, prop, I'll wear the sleep dress as a proper sleep dress, and I'm going to wear the jacket. So now, um, to accessorize, I'll probably go for um, blue shoes. So because of the way the style of the dress is, it's a two-tone two ombre dress. So it has, I think, two or three steps of color. I would do a nice green bag for accessory because you have to hold it which is a bit up and then I'll do a blue shoes for my you know as part of the accessory for my feet um, I feel like in my head I'm thinking I'm thinking it's kind of like going to go you know like almost like it's the same color <laughs> I don't know how to explain it to you but wait, if you're seeing it if you if you know you know you understand that's the important thing you understand you, you get the idea behind the style uh how else will i style this but the second way for me to style this would be to pair the jacket with denim um like i said denim is one of the things i didn't see a lot in 2023 and i feel like it's a very nice trend to be part of because denim is not like a short it's not um, a short lived kind of friend trend it's not a short lived trend it's um a classic and it's something that you can always wear and never goes out of this goes out of style so yeah so i probably pair it with um, white camisole tanning and um a pair of sneakers and then switch that up for a pair of heels if i want my look to be limited for handbags i would do with something that has a pop of color um i'll probably go with like green bag or a turquoise bag it's one of the two um so you can always switch up your style so you whatever <clears throat> you can wear the first time and use it with the accessory a and then wear it the second time and then change your accessories just it's still like a different look tweak it you know here and there the third style for me would be to pair the white blazers with pink skirts so um but this that was switching out the the brown bodysuit for like a white camisole or a white or a white bodysuit whatever that is white that you have in your wardrobe or even like in a lighter shade of pink because this is fuchsia pink so you can do like a baby pink or candy cotton pink or even peach so basically you can look for um something that is light colored camisole top bodysuit that you can pair that with and obviously the white the cream colored or white colored jacket um but for this style, I would pair it with sneakers just to give you like a different sporty vibe kind of look. Um, you can obviously dress it up um, if you want, add a pair of heels and just elevate the look entirely. And don't forget to accessorize as much as you can. 
pair it with a nice pair of nice handbags in white maybe or in pink or in fuchsia just to have just to add um a refreshing look to it style and <laughs> fashion and style is a personal thing it's something that you develop and as time passes you get to choose you know the what's best for you what fits you more and the rest of that it's it's absolutely your choice you can wear whatever the hell you want to wear style it the way you want um but yeah these are like opinions or ideas from me if you wish to call it that um yeah um the third item that i brought out to restart is the the orange um poplin kimono inspired shirt i got this a few months ago i think i got it in february and i shot it for my valentine's day um inspired outfit that i could wear for dinner or uh, galantine and it was one of the items that were in my galantine boots if i remember correctly so in the video i paired it with um the pink skirt and um a really nice orange beaded bag that was gifted to me by my friend and of course with a pink shoe so i did orange up and then i did pink down um definitely one of the ways that you can style this um you know dinner brunch girls night out kind of vibe this is what you're going to get um but yeah that's another way to start you know to pair, to pair that with movie night it's, it's a great style for like movie night or dinner or like you know a very casual meeting you know something like that um the next thing that the next way that i would um i would pair this or style this outfit would be to pair it with the see-through um the see see-through trousers um, if you remember the trousers that I wore for my birthday that I got from Pretty Little Thing, um, it would be another way to style this, another way to wear the entire outfit. Um, I feel that because the shirt is loose and thick, it's going to be a bit more decent, but adds a little bit of flirty, sexy um, vibe to the outfit. Uh, um, to dress it up, you can wear heels, elevate the look, to make it look chic and classy. To dress it down, you can opt for a pair of white um half slippers or half shoes i think that's what it's called i don't know exactly but i'll find the name and i'll put it in the description so you can try that you can go with as many different colors you want to pair that with as you want but for me to play it safe i would do white i would do orange i would do maybe red and top white something not too off the menu but something that also brings sort of a refreshing taste to the entire outfit and i think that's pretty much it uh so yeah if you enjoyed this video don't forget to like it give it a thumbs up um share subscribe and leave me a comment and tell me what type of style that you want me to you know show you or outfits that you want me to restyle or give me ideas of videos that you want me to film okay i hope this video has been interesting and fun for you um please don't forget to share this and encourage people to come and watch and subscribe to my channel and i'll see you in the next one bye